Hey, hello and welcome to this new tutorial by Flowmotion. Or maybe this isn't even a tutorial, this is maybe just really awesome news. Because, as you can see, hello, my name is... ProRes. And by the way, I'm on a Windows machine here. So this is really, really great news. Because by today, with the new version of After Effects, you are finally able to render out all your nice ProRes codecs. A small step for mankind, but a huge step for your client delivery. And it's pretty easy, the After Effects team just brought it right into your render output module. So when I'm adding this composition to the render queue, I can go to QuickTime and at the video codex, there I have all of my nice video codex. 422, it even goes up to 444XQ, which is really great and kind of a standard these days. And also they have brought it into the media encoder. So once again in the composition, you could send it to the Adobe media encoder, which will automatically open up the media encoder and already brings your composition in there. And by the way, this is a really great way to render something with the media encoder and then while it's rendering you can go back into After Effects and work on your project or another project. So a really nice and handy workflow. So in here you just change your format to a quick time and then select your codec. So really powerful and by the way you can also do that in Premiere Pro. So really, really great news and I really hope that you're as happy as I am about the fact that we now have ProRes on a Windows machine.